Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music and in today's lesson I'm going to teach you how to play the Candyman theme, okay? It's a beautiful and also haunting theme. It's pretty awesome. It goes like this, give you a preview of the section you're going to learn in today's lesson. It goes like this, check it out. Anyways, very beautiful theme. That's the section we're going to learn today's lesson. All right, let's go ahead and break it up into four parts so it's easier to learn. The first part goes like this. Right hand starts on the C, one octave above middle C here, okay? So right here. So C, D, E flat, D, C, C, B. And that's it for the first part for the right hand. Pretty straightforward, not that many notes. So one more time, it goes C, D, E flat, D, C, C, B. That's it for the right hand. Once you get that left hand, these are the following notes we have. Okay, has this kind of C minor Alberti bass played twice. So starting on the middle, C up to G, E flat, G, C, G, E flat, G, and then down octave to the lower G, and then octave above G, D, G, and then down to A, back up to G, down to B, up to G. That's it for the left hand for the first part. Let's do it again. So Alberti bass on C minor for two times. Down to G, up to higher G, D, G, A, up to G, down to B, up to G. That's it for the left hand for the first part. Once you get that two hands together, it goes like this. So it goes together, together, together. It. Pretty easy for the first part. So it goes like this when it's faster. So together, together, together. Together, together. Like that. Alright, now moving on to the second part. Okay, so the second part's pretty easy. Okay, uh, the second part right hand is the half of it is actually pretty much the same. So this is the same. And then it changes. Right hand goes up to A flat. Okay? So that's the only difference. So da, 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 up to A flat. That's the right hand, okay? Left hand, as I said, the first half is the same, the C minor Alberti bass. And then the second half is different. Goes down to A flat, up to F, down to C, F, back up to F, and then down to B flat, back up to F, down to B, up to F. That's it for the left hand, okay? So, left hand, one more time. So, C minor, Alberti plays twice the same as the first part, and then changes here down to A flat, up to F, C, F, B flat, up to F, B, F. All right, two hands together, goes like this. So, first half is the same as the first part, so. And then together. Pretty easy, okay? That's the second part. So, one more time, so together. That's it for the second part. So back to back, the two parts we've learned so far would we'll be playing like this. Check it out. Right, now, moving on, the third part is actually exactly the same as the first part, so we just save some time by knowing that, okay? So back to... Moving on to the fourth and last part, okay? This fourth and last part um, changes up a tiny bit. So, well, it's not even really because it's actually the, still the same first half. This is the same, the Alberta bass. And then right hand this time goes up to the octave above C. And then B flat, A flat. Like that. Just like that. So, da -da -da -da, C up to octave C. B flat, A flat. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, once again, we have the C minor Alberti place. C minor Alberti bass played twice. Okay, so like this, twice. And once again, down to the A flat, up to F, C, F, and repeat that for the second time, like that. So instead of doing da 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 da, this time it's twice like this. All right. 
right, so pretty easy stuff. So C minor, Alberti bass, and then the first inversion of F minor, Alberti bass twice. Yeah, pretty easy to remember. Okay, two hands together, goes like this, so the first half is the same as the other parts, so like this. High C and the A flat together. The last two notes together. Like that. That's it, one more time, so together. Together. There you have it. So back to back, all four parts of this lesson will be played like this. Check it out. Very beautiful theme to play and it's good for Halloween as well. And yeah, that's that by the way. If you want to learn more creepy and beautiful themes and like Halloween themes as well, go ahead, search up all my channel and you'll find it and you can learn it. Okay, but anyways, that's pretty much it for today's lesson. If you enjoyed this lesson, make sure to check out the rest of my channel because literally there are multiple thousands and thousands of these videos ranging from pop songs of all languages, meme songs, video game music, movie, anime and cartoon theme songs and many more songs of all sorts that I teach. So most likely you can find your favorite song to learn on my channel. Also check out my website, bestpianomethod.com, linked in the description below if you want to learn more piano from me. Learn from my piano courses on how to play by ER, improvise, read sheet music, how to play and sing, and many more courses at all types of levels, even for those who have never touched a piano before. As for now, enjoy your time around my channel and see you next time.